second game of the day and we actually have just gone live so I, I, I would like comedians to just switch to the TF2 game immediately as uh, we've gone live here for the first round I think we have gone yeah we have actually gone live I just completely messed that up for just a second here my name is Pledge with me is comedian for today and uh, we have infused pretty much I would like to say crowd favorites massive favorites seriously I think they have 99 to 1 odds to win this tournament you know what? Um, if, if I would have to you know if I would put down one cent I would not get any money back if no. they win. If you put, if you put like, seriously, if you put a hundred dollars in if you winning this tournament, you lose money. That is how much <laughs> they are favorite. They're gonna be playing as 9M. We actually just saw them completely destroying the guys who were supposed to destroy based on their clan name. And right now <laughs> we're seeing Infused actually losing the first middle. Bam, there you go. Greg is playing Medic. They're gonna play off class. Uh, everything is ridiculous. Numlock's playing Soldier. Dunk is playing Soldier. Greg is playing Medic. Mike and Flisk are playing Scout. And our Finnish hero, Cookie, is playing Demo. Right. And Nine Man is just saying, you know what, if you're going to start wait, like wait. that, we're going to tear you apart. Pledge, That's the way it goes. Pledge, you're not on the STV. Are you? I'm not really sure if I'm on the STV. Are I on the STV? Because I'm on the STV, and I'm like, I haven't started yet. You're a spectator! I'm a spectator. You, you, oh, oh, I messed that pledge, up. Pledge, Pledge, you're a spectator. I messed that oh. up. I was like, wait a second. That's okay. That, how did I, oh. That's okay, oh. my man. Ah, oh, there's a snake one on the wrong server as well. Make, Take it away, comedian. <laughs> Just show me what you're showing on the stream. Yeah. That's okay. We're allowed to mess up. It's early today. Uh, it's early, sorry. We were, we were just woken up, and uh, yeah, we can see both teams running out. Spoiler, I think if you is gonna, it's gonna lose this. I think if you is gonna <laughs> run Greg as medic. I'm not sure. <laughs> I think they are. Yeah, they are running Greg as medic. There we go. See, so, yeah, Rock Soldier's going pretty aggressively right here, and uh, Infuse is just being uh, set to this corner, and I am just taking a high ground. Look at that medic just standing on top of the crates right there. Finally dropping down. Scout is going in from the right hand flank. It's gonna get uh, forced out. And there's your uh, Ubers are ready for both teams. Ubers are being popped. And uh, Bones is getting a few kills. Uh, spoiler alert, nine men wins this middle. Uh, spoiler uh, alert. Uh, spoiler alert, spoiler alert. Yeah, they still have the <laughs> medic up. Demo man, just, uh, just a scout right there. And uh, the medic uh, trying to uh, get a cross ball off. <laughs> It's gonna be a little intimidating though. I mean, look at this. You're, you're, you're Sticko and Sarah standing in the middle together, and there's Mike standing there, a scout just on the other side. Like, I don't, yeah. I'm just gonna go in, whatever. Like, it's gonna be a little intimidating to have a player like that standing on the opposite and side. Actually, of the look middle. at that. Uh, Mike just goes in and takes down, I think, on a medic. Uh, we do have boats, Bones and uh, Clive right there taking down Greg. So, both medics are down right now, and uh, three players down. Fuse. Once again, a little roster rundown. We have uh, Sarah on Medic for nine men. We have Sticko on Demo Man. Clive and Bones are going to be playing Scout. Bones is the super sub for today. And we have Pork and Gamble, Superstar Soldiers for nine men on the blue side. And uh, nine men is actually going to pick up this second point. We have Mike on Scout on the other side for Infused. Flisco's playing Scout as well. Nomlock and Dunk are going to be playing Soldier. Greg is on Medic. And Cookie's playing Demo Man. And yes, Infuse is playing full off class. We're going to see how that changes through the course of this game. Nightman keeps going like this. Oh, uh, there we go. Clive was trying to get in to Greg, trying to come down, and didn't manage to do that. They have a bit of an uber advantage. Nomlock is going heavy, and they are pushing out to the point. So, uh, yeah, Infuse is actually uh, doing fairly well here, grabbing that second point as. Uh, Apparently, comedian, the music is still on. That's what I was trying to say. <laughs> it's not on. Okay, well, it's, it's okay. A, it's not on. N NF is actually saying, there you go. So I was actually just reading the chat. So we'll see. As uh, Gamble's actually doing surprisingly good work here together with Pork once again. Pork did go down there barely in the end, though, as uh, Infused looking reasonably fine, to be honest. But I don't think they're going to push for this middle just yet. They have a 20% leeward advantage. But in all honesty, to be honest, comedian, Infused is not taking this as seriously so no, no, oh, no, no. actually are counting viewers there you go and actually got to push they know they have an advantage this is the difference between like nine men at the start of last game where they yeah. didn't realize they had advantages whatsoever and now where infuse is just pushing on even though they're playing off glass it's just the mindset of a pro player they count all the time but you know what stickies nobody checks stickies at what level no no one checks for stickies ever they were just trying to go for a risk. Didn't imagine to do it. You know, Ubers are equal right now. Actually, look at that. Scout trying to go in. Bones trying to take down. Greg uh, forced him off. Actually, uh, Nightman is trying to uh, go into the initiative right now. Trying to get some kills off. 
I'm just uh, kind of checking around if anything well, is happening to the Infuse lineup at the moment. Yeah. No. It, like, my question really is, when is Infuse going to change it and if they are going to change? Like, if nine men, if they keep winning middles, if they maybe get a round or two in, like, when is Infuse going to decide, you know what, enough is enough, we're going to win this game? I think, I think with five minutes remaining, you know, like if they're still, you know, not they're winning, behind. Yeah. <laughs> they're just going to go on class and just kill Double everything. Double backup, by the way, here from nine men. I just want to point that out. There's three people from Infuse running back. Obviously, the coordination is not as perfect as it usually would be. Point does get capped, though. Is there anyone from Nyman actually running to last? I'm looking at Clive. Yeah, Clive is actually running to last. Takes him down. Clive's going to cap this off. Bam! One to zero. All right. And there we go. Very, very nice run there. Uh, the, the, the only question that remains, like, is Infuse going to play on class? No, nope, seems like nope. Numlock, They're going to keep going. Dunk. Are still on Soldier, Cookie still on Demo and Greg. They, they believe Medic, in warm up. On, on they, they believe uh, in warm up. You know. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, this is the upper bracket second round at the moment. Um, the top four teams so far have made it here. There's a lower bracket, though, so all eight teams in the brackets are still in. But uh, we're going to cast games one by one from this stage onwards. You're not going to miss any game so far. We're going to cast low and high level, upper and lower bracket, everything so far. And it looks like Infused has finally found their game. Um, well, finally, I think they've already had it, but Nine Men actually took advantage of that during the first round. Infuse got to pick this up, though, but once again, Nine Men still very meticulous in their play. I mean, Sarah, get out of life, Demo's still alive, making the smart decision of dropping back early. It's fine like this. They're just making the right decisions, um, but, you know, Infuse has the experience and knowledge, you know, they're, they are all prime players. And actually, look at that. Uh, Medic actually gets cut off right there. And it's being juggled by Numlock. And uh, they do pop their Uber, and, but they're just going to cap this point. So that back cap's not going to do anything to them. And they're just going to roll into the last point. <laughs> uh, I guess four players, no Medic. <laughs> Great shot from Dunk there with Sarah. I don't know if you caught that, but Sarah was actually hiding uh, across the corner. Dunk saw, saw her. Killed her in an air shot. Like the double scout backup's not going to work. Clive should have not tried. Clive should have tried that in the previous game. They would have gotten torn apart. Like, that's, that's the thing. Like, nine men played so together last game, and now they're trying, like, this ridiculous backup. Like, don't do it. Just fight the team, yeah, Clive. Yeah. Against a team, that, that, against a team of a fuse, you're not going to manage to get a single backup. They're too... They know they, what they, they need to do. They know what they need to do to cover a backup. It's the way it works, you know? The higher level you get in TF2, it's the best way to just play, and the best way to get better is to just cover backups, to do backups yourself, coordinate as much as possible on that kind of stuff. And uh, on middle, obviously, that doesn't matter. The only thing that matters on middle is aggression. It's, it's uh, team positioning, work, I would like to say. Work. Yeah, exactly. And there we go. As they go, Bones getting a few nice skills right there. Dunk. And everyone is just getting wiped. Six for zero. Six for zero? Nine men, six for zero. I mean, would we say that seriously? Look, think about it. Like, would we say before this weekend, a uh, nine man just uh, six zero wiped infused on middle on granary? Like, we wouldn't, we wouldn't I, dare to dream to say <laughs> that. Yeah, you know, but you know, if they would have been playing on class, it probably would have been the case. all over Mike's face, yeah. got obliterated in mid air, two to one. And when is load. infused? And I, I keep, I'm going to keep asking this question all day long. When is Infuse going to say, you know what, we're sick of it, we're going to play a main class now? And I, to be honest, I'm not sure they're going to do it at all. I think they, it's just more fun for them this way. It's more fun for everyone this way. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Plus, we can get some officers. I'm, I'm going to look at Cookie. I'm going to see if he's, like, super bad. Let me check. Uh, where, where is he? There he is. He's actually going to go from top. Um, what you see very often nowadays, you have two scouts playing from top. It looks like Infuse so far plays with one scout from bottom, one scout up top. Cookie just kind of spam by his lightning anyway. This is terrible. Actually got Sticko with a pipe. Wow, I cannot believe he actually hit that. Mike and uh, his scout partner, Blisco, kind of a weird thing to say, coming in from the flank, getting four picks. There you go. That cleans up the middle. Five picks, yeah. actually. Five kills by the scouts. And weird as it is, if you change your soldiers to scouts, they are still going to have the teamwork. So it's still going to work perfectly yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah. And that's what you saw at display right there. Yeah, that, that's a good call. That's a good call. Uh, we do see the demo, uh, the medic going down Greg right there. He got bombed in. So, um, you know, at least not going to be a complete wall. Uh, Bones going for the heavy on the last point. And uh, let's see if actually, uh, <laughs> if if you can do something against it. No, non locked was standing at the forward spot, the second spawn. And obviously, you get the forward spawn. Numlock didn't have the health on Solar to jump back, so he's gonna have to walk all the way through. It did, like, seriously, Dunk respawned, opened the door for him, but he was like, I got 20 HP, I can't jump back. <laughs> so he has to run it all the way. Where is he? He's probably like on middle at the moment or something. Uh, Let's see. 
Yeah, he, he just barely joined his team. And he's still not getting heals. Look at that. He's still not getting heals from his it, medic. It was, it was so just waiting for the medium map back. Uh, oh. Nah, Infuse is going to take it easy. I mean, this is, for them, the best way to start the day is take it easy. See what they can do. Um, Nine men definitely taking it a little bit more serious than that. As right now, it seems like only Pork is having trouble fragging. The rest seems perfectly fine with his 2 on lead. And uh, Infuse is going to come into last here in just a second. They lost Bones and Clive very early. Their boat's going to spawn in time. Clive is not. So we have a 6 versus 5 scenario here where Infuse is just spamming, spamming, spamming as much as possible. Pork gets dropped, though. 5 versus 4 scenario, uh, basically fragging wise. And we can see that, uh, yeah. Clive did spawn, Pork, Bones, both gone down. Bones, what are you doing? He went down, came and joined the fight, and actually died immediately after. Infuse cleaning it up one by one. The, the slow push on left side is so valuable for any team out there. If you're looking for a granary stat strat you want to do on last, really, go from the left side, bomb in one soldier at, like, the sniper spot, and just slow push forwards because the enemy's not going to have enough spam to actually force that uber unless they suicide in a player. And that's when you have a 6 versus 5 scenario. That's the way you want to do it. And, and to be honest, I do it with my team quite a bit. Is to just play that way in an uber versus uber scenario and you're able to do it. Uh, but is there anything you can do uh, against that? Yeah, of course. Run a sniper. You win the game. <laughs> that's the way it goes. <laughs> Run a sniper on the left side and you get completely destroyed. <laughs> you cannot do that anymore, but... We're going to see how Greg is going to be able to play this meta. He's just healing anyway. Look at this. Greg is going, I'm not playing medic whatsoever. Oh, there are my players. I'm just going to heal them up while they kill everything. And uh, that's the way Infuse is playing right now. Why is Nine Man staying in? Make a smart decision. Go away, please. Yeah, just leave. Just leave. There we go. Oh, uh, did you Mike actually put the, the, the news, uh... is, look, look at this. Look at this. Mike is standing behind him. He's like, whatever. I don't care. Following Sarah. Right? Sarah hasn't even seen him. Now, he's, now she sees him. And yeah, you mean Double me a shot the right there. Uh. A, <laughs> let's go. Go down as well. To be honest, it's the way, way it goes. Where you have ridiculously talented, skilled players, like the like the, um, the infused players, you really it doesn't matter which class they're playing, they're gonna be super good anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, they're not gonna be as good as you know on class, and uh, <laughs> uh, you know. Now, nah, players like Numlock, whether or not they're playing demo or soldier, uh, they know they're still what good. they need to do. They know when where do they need to stand, especially players like Numlock. To, to you know, they're they're the callers. They they attack this player. Um, Anyway, you can see a uh, few kills again going to Infuse favor right there. They're just jumping around, batting, uber shawing. Uh Actually, uh, 9M staying alive with uh, the scout and the medic. Uh, Greg is coming in, though. Greg is is Clive going to do it? Is Clive going to do it? No, it's not going to happen. He's just going to heal. Uh, 3 to 2 at the moment for Infuse. They're going to keep on the up classing for now. 18 minutes, uh, 18 and a half minutes remaining, actually. Uh, just want to point out for anyone having internet issues, I'm just looking at the chart. Yeah, uh, we, we had some problems last night. Comedian stayed up all night overclocking his PC to make sure it just wasn't his fault. And even though it still looks a little bit laggy, it is mainly the problem with the internet here. We yeah. have we do not have a shared box, so we basically share the internet with the entire room. So it's going to be a little bit, um, it's a little bit weird, a little bit unexpected. But sometimes it might hiccup a little bit on the stream, but it should still be watchable. So we apologize for any convenience, and uh, we hope you still enjoy the show. Yeah. Uh, well, of course, we're going to be doing everything we can to solve that issue. Anyway, on the middle point there, look at all this infused players being very, very, very weak. Uh, but Nine Man is just being focused out of there. I nice think um, Flesco, do take get two kills right there. And uh, are they going to actually uh, push back? And yeah, they are. They even have a ten percent Uber advantage, so maybe they can uh, try and force something. Double scout Uber right there, going aggressively. Takes down Dunk. Greg is going to get forced. He does a uh, pop right there. Sarah. Almost uh, serves all up until the point, but uh, actually got taken down already. Uh, and it's just uh, Clive. He gets taken down by Numlock. Valiant effort, to be honest, from my man. They, they, they keep going. They keep showing passion just on these middles. Just keep, they keep moving. They keep saying, you know what? I don't care what they play. I don't care what if we have a chance or not. We're just going to keep moving. And we're going to see if we can make something happen here. And to be honest, they're doing a very good job so far. 3-2 to two is definitely not completely out of this yet. I mean, who knows what happens in the next 17 minutes. Maybe Infuse literally loses two caps now, and then they mess up, and they're just, you know, I don't know, they, they switch to their own classes too late, and they actually lose the game, and Nine Men is in the upper record final. Yeah. Nobody knows. Like, it, it can happen. And Nine Men is fighting for that super small chance of just being able to, to, to play in the upper bracket final before dropping down to the lower, lower bracket. And uh, we're at a 3-2 scoreline at the moment. Infused... Yeah, still no classes change. Everything is still the same. No reason for them to change. And the hero of last game, Pork, is having trouble at the moment. And what do you think is the is the reason for that? 
I know. He's like, you know, he's just a cartoon. Views, it's a tough thing to do. Like, it's the way it goes. <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't know. I, I haven't seen him team up so much with uh, with his partner Gambles. Gambles actually getting two nice kills right there, and actually look at three players getting cut off right there. Uh, just uh, just numlock scout and uh, Mike Mike uh, getting away right there. Yep. Pork and about three players still left though. Up against Mike. Mike, are you gonna be able to do anything? Or is Pork no. gonna pick up his next no, frag? No, actually, what he is gets gonna Look at it. Why does it take so long? <laughs> oh, I hate it when that happens and when you're a medic, you cannot actually do anything. You can only actually, shout Uber, to your players. Uber saw the scout. Yeah, there you, you go. got an Uber saw. So, you know, he's actually. Yeah. actually. I, I, I'm gonna go on a limb. Sarah's gonna die before she has the Uber. Gonna go on a limb here. Okay, we have 10%. Let's see uh, what, if that's gonna happen. <laughs> see, I, I don't know actually. Gonna there, there's actually soldier Uber. scouts coming in from the side. Soldier jumping up right there. She does have Uber right there and she does pop. Uh, so, uh, that one frag each at the moment, fire. though. Numlock goes down to a soldier, so that's very well played. To poor getting two frags there during that exchange. Yep. Three to one at the moment. It's a good exchange you want to do when you have an Uber. Greg stayed alive, though. 60% on him only as Duncan and Fliss go around, though. But with Dunk there as a soldier, he's going to be able to build this Uber perfectly fine. We'll see what happens. Uh, the only problem was Infuse has had so far it was yesterday evening. I don't know if anyone caught that. But um, yesterday evening we had a spec and dunk, uh, a spec and dunk, a spec and bite, actually casting the game between Infuse and Elemental Violence. And after we spoke to Infuse, after Bite spoke to Infuse in an interview and said to Nomlock, you know what, Elemental Violence are pretty good. They started on Clash, and even though that happened, the game was super close, and it was, it was in really, the end, it was a 7-2 really to two win, but I think it was like 3-2 at some point, and Elemental yeah. Violence did fantastically. And remember, this was Infuse playing on Clash. This was yeah. not them. Yeah. You know, they started on class. They realized. They started on class. They finished on class. They played on class the entire thing around. And they managed to struggle with elemental violence. In the end, obviously, 7 2 on Gullywash. But it's not the end of the world. So, elemental violence is definitely the second team so far from what I can see. But the Twisted Play uh, mix from like the, the old school Twisted Play guys, 9M, who actually stepped it up today, beating AP. And AP themselves, they're not out of it yet. They're still sitting there in the lower bracket. And they have fantastic players in their lineup. Yeah, there's you cannot really like the the battle for second and third is actually very interesting during the tournament. And Infuse playing off class against one of those teams, you know what? It's, it's more of the same. Really, we're going to see this quite a bit. Just Infuse uh, kind of uh, screwing around, winning their games, and up until the final, or up until the next time they meet Elemental Violence, they're just going to play off class. Uh, and let's see, just uh, going back to the game right here. Uh, so it looked like Infuser was trying to push back into the middle. Actually, yeah, look at that scout on the right hand flank. Uh, Mike taking on Bones. And uh, actually starting to cap already. Um, but I don't think actually they can really push into that. I mean, like, even with the Uber advantage, it's going to be dodgy. But there we go. They're actually going in right there, putting some pressure onto Terra. Terra, they managed to get out of there. Surf, Terra, their port gets taken down as well. And they're actually just going to secure this middle point. And uh, completing one of the hardest pushes in the game. <laughs> Except for Freight last. We, yeah, except for Freight last. <laughs> Maybe Obscure last, but I was actually speaking to Firestorm, one of the admins last night. Obscure last is not unpushable, like Freight. Like, Freight is, like, proper unpushable. Obscure is no, no, tough, no. not unpushable. You, you know what's actually the worst push in the game? Obscure going in from, uh, from second, third. You know what the worst push is in the That's game? That's the worst push in the game. The second cap from the first stage of Gold Rush. Oh, that, that is the worst! That is the most unpushable that CP is, ever. Oh. Try and push the cart like through Sniper Alley, that's no way, it's never gonna work. Oh, that, that's so bad, oh. Right, anyway, back to the game here as we have uh, Nyman actually successfully holding on to this middle point. Two and a half minutes remaining on the clock, still 3-2 to two lead. You're joining us here at I-45, Insomnia 45 in Telford, in the UK with Comedian and Pledge on the mics. Uh, we still have Bite, Cube and Bones here around as well, and yes, that is the Bones you can see in the game. Uh, he's working for another TV this event, but he's going to be playing occasionally throughout the day. Because yeah. obviously, uh, Nine Man is missing a player. I have no idea who it is, actually. Uh, I'm paying attention. You know, yesterday. you know, it, it's actually now it's just their players' bones. Yeah, there he's you go. He's going to be playing. He's going to be playing all day. So uh, we're going to see how that's going to work out for Nine Men. We saw the last game, and we're going to keep seeing them throughout the day. From now on, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to cost every single game of the tournament. There's not a single game that is going to get played that we don't cost. So we're going to cost lower bracket, upper bracket, every single round up until the grand final, which is tomorrow at 1 yep. p.m. And we're going to cost till about midnight today. So we got still got about, uh, I think we got exactly nine games left from now on, and the next game is going to be in eight minutes. We're a little bit behind schedule. There's a couple of best of threes in there, but we'll see what we're going to be able to do till about midnight. We're going to rotate the casters around. So thanks very much for already joining us here in the morning at Vanilla TV, where we have some fantastic TF2 action coming at you throughout the entire day. 
Now, of course, uh, we can see Infuse uh, pushing in. They do have fifty percent rebus advantage. We're going to attribute to putting some pressure onto uh, onto the combo. Actually, Skyrim running in from behind. Clive uh, gets taken down. Gamble's down as well. Bones down as well. They're just trying to suicide players and try and get their medic or something. Some you know glorious shots, and they can put it on their frag movies or something. Uh, but everyone just getting picked off one by one, and it just SDK out on it. He's going to put down some sticky. He's going to try and kill everyone. Takes down Numlocked. But the rest takes him down, and it's going to be 4 to 2. 11 minutes remaining on the clock, and Infused once again, just taking it easy. And um, really, like, even though 9M is trying, you know, you can see Infused just solidly just kind of playing along and uh, having some fun. I mean, th that's that's the thing. Whenever you are a sort of high-level team, so like Prem, Diff 1, and maybe Top Diff 2-ish, whenever you play off glass with the same six players as you play in a regular team, yeah, you still have a main caller. You still, like, even though you joke around, you still main call, you still count Ubers. That's just in your brain. It just works that way. You taught yourself to think that. Yeah. You can see that they infused every single time they have Uber time, they push. Yeah, because yeah, they, yeah. they know they have an advantage. They know what they can do. And even though they're playing off fast, that still happens because that's, that's how it works in the brain of a pro player. Because if you actually have to think about it instead of act on it and just, like, naturally do it, you're not going to be on the top of the game, no. you know. You just have to. You just have to naturally have it. Otherwise, it's just not going to be good. <laughs> um, anyway, just yeah, infused again, pushing. You know, just going in. It's going to be an Uber for super situation right here on the CP2. Uh, let's see uh, what 9M is going to be doing. Yeah, they're going to be pushing in. Take down Numlock. They take down Mike. That's two players down. They get forced up, but uh, they do lose Dunk as well. So going to try it, and they're going to have to force the uber right here and the uber does get forced they do take cookies so it's just uh it's just flisco and greg alive right now and there we go soldier bomb again and 9m is going to be uh pushing for very very aggressively right there greg trying to get a uh, crossbow shot off right there gets one off but it's not going to be enough to it's a five to one exchange actually so that's pretty good i actually managed to pick off greg once again well played clive Picking him off there on that flank while he was retreating. If he's going to try to fight this though, <laughs> Mike about 5 HP missing the map pack. I don't know if you saw that. He was flying yeah, I was around. like, what? <laughs> he actually missed the map pack, didn't end up taking it. And Dunk, oh, uh, we have Dunk hiding. This is probably the one spot, seriously, if, if you can find Dunk for me. This is the one spot that he dies to all the time when he's playing Medic himself. Really? He's like, he walks to the right side and there's a soldier hiding there and he rages. <laughs> he was like, you know what? I'm going to try that myself. And it's gonna work, and he's gonna make it work. I just, I, I'm gonna pay attention to that. Right, As a right. scout comes through, he's gonna jump in. Is he gonna? He manage goes, to make he it goes work? in, and he forced the Uber. He actually did force the Uber, so that's exactly that, what happens. Like in pro exactly matches, happened, so yeah. And then uh, poor, uh, poor gang gambles gonna go down. Well, he did what he had to do. <laughs> that's kind of ridiculous. Man actually, you know, they, they, I don't think they're as greedy as they can possibly be here. To be honest, like they, they, they're gonna get forced. But they took down Dunk. They had another player down at the time as well. And to be honest, Greg does not have the Uber. And this is the thing we were talking about earlier. Nine men doesn't have an exact Uber count on the enemy. And they don't really know if they can push. Because the thing is, if they push and the enemy suddenly has Uber, they just die. It's the way right. it goes. But if they have a specific count on that Uber, I mean, obviously now you hear the, I have all what charge. Like, you, you, have, you have the call. You, they know yeah. that Greg has the Uber right now. So they're going to be able to play on that. But as, as long as you don't know... It is, you, you, you're you kind of just in the dark, kind of like you're, when you're StarCraft, you're not scouting or something. It's very tough to play that way. Yeah, indeed. Uh, but, you know, I do wonder, like, yeah, most medics have, you know, binds masking that Uber call constantly, doing fake Ubers and everything. I don't think Greg has that at the moment. <laughs> That'd be interesting, like, you know, here, To done. be honest, every player should have that, just in general in their medic conflict. I, <laughs> I don't have explode binded, you know, I, I, those things don't, don't matter for well, me. You don't? So. No, man. Everyone has explode binded. And everyone does explode instead of kill because explode is more fun. Explode is way more fun. <laughs> you just go, uh, kill is just like you fall down. It's like uh, there you go. boring. Yeah, once again, ladies and gentlemen, it's if it's lagging, it's it's okay. Like we're, we apologize. We cannot really do anything about it. It's just the internet uh, kind of screwing over here in England. I mean, I, I think everyone has been Virgin complaining media, about Virgin man. Media everywhere. <laughs> so uh, that is yeah. the excuse that we have. Uh, might not be the real reason, but we're gonna use it as an excuse. As yesterday. Comedian until about three in the morning, overclock this PC for the sole purpose of having a better stream for you guys. Yeah, so. You know what it is? It was actually just like said multiplier that was sixteen to nineteen. That was that was it. That was done. It still takes it, a it long took, time. It though. took five minutes. Oh, there you go. It doesn't take a long time. <laughs>
Okay, so I'm sorry. I'm giving you credit. You're not accepting. That's yeah, fine. Yeah, you know, uh, you know, but I was <laughs> testing afterwards to make sure the temperatures and everything was fine. Six right? and a half minutes remaining best. on the clock here, though. We have a four to two lead for off glass infused, and uh, I just saw someone asking, "What does off glass mean?" It's just if the guy who plays medic suddenly plays any other class within the team, and now, right now, everyone from infused is playing something else than what they usually play. So yeah. they're, they're not like a hundred percent in their skill. They're just kind of, I don't know, like fifty percent or something on their skill. And uh, they're still fine. They're still fine taking down nine men, but you can say whatever you want. Nine men is holding on. They're playing fine. They're making the right decisions. The only thing I can really say about them is that they just they need to count the Uber. They need to know what they're up against. And that's the yeah. one thing that I saw last game as well that they're really missing. I don't know if it's because it's like noon or something and everyone's been up until 3 a.m. last Could night. Could be a possibility. It might be. But really, it's a general skill you want to have. And with nine men being in Division 3, they need to be able to perfect that more and more and more. And, uh, well, you know, that those are just things you need to learn. Um, what, what I don't see this game, and what they did see this game, is the soldiers partnering up and, you know, doing the coordinated push and everything. Anyway, we see uh, Cookie getting taken out right now. And, uh, seeing a uh, Nightman trying to push in. Mike is actually a spy. Is he spy? I'm yeah, gonna, he's I'm look him up. Actually, he's all the way behind. Whoa. He's all the way behind already, yeah. Um, he's actually hiding inside the enemy main base right now. Um, uh, no, you, you look, I mean, <laughs> the push is actually wow. happening. They're gonna coordinate this push with Mike. Is Mike gonna be able to get anything done, though? It's, uh, quite difficult. I'm looking at Sarah, nothing's happening so far. Is anything- No, nobody's uh, looking for a spy. What is he gonna do? Is he gonna cap? Yeah, uh, he's, he's gonna go for the back step. Just go for the cap? What is he doing? Come on, Mike! Come on, come on, get him! Two players coming in from behind. Is the point gonna get capped? No, it is no! not! And no. Nine Man manages to cap that second point. The backup was not quick enough. If only Mike was a good spy. If only Mike was a good spy. <laughs> there we go. We it's easier as he can make it happen, isn't it? He's still alive, actually. He's not died so far. Where is he? He's still behind. Like, everyone... People should know by now. Like, there's a scout there. Yeah, there seeing Mike. Go. Mike's gonna go to the duel with him, and he's gonna get battered in his face. Well played by Clive. They're coming in from the side, taking him down. As uh, Dunk gets a pick on Gambles, and quite surely, Infused, they, knowing them, they're just going to push on this, even though uh, Sarah actually already has that Uber on the blue side. Well, uh, do you think they're going to try and push in, or just to go? Uh, Not anymore. They send it in Numlock to Fort. But look look at where Infused is standing. They're just going to die. Sure, look at the scouts are coming in from the side. Right here, now uh, everyone's coming in. The Uber is getting popped there, so they're going to try. This goes on the back up. Yeah. Mm. They're gonna, that is gonna be got, there. No, he got it. He got, he got it. He got it. No got one's it. actually running. Oh, there's a soldier there. Is he gonna take him down? Yes, he is. But the point already got capped. Ooh, Gamble's yeah. a little bit too late. Like slightly, too late, slightly too late. Too late. Oh, we do still have no more Clive. He's gonna take down Clive. Uh, and just hanging around. We're on CP2. Don't getting. Wow, don't getting a lot of picks. Ooh. The guy's a better soldier than we thought. Ah, he's, he's quite good. <laughs> for, for a medic, he got good aim. Let's let's put it that way. Uh. Let's like see. A, we have three and a half minutes remaining. Obviously, it's still possible, comedian. Like we sh we should not like we're kind of jokingly around casting. It is do, actually do, still do possible you, for nine men to do this. But do you think it's gonna happen? I don't Realistically. know. Realistically, might be. Like it would be cool, wouldn't it? Like, it would be awesome. It would be amazing if that happened. But we can see infused. I would actually, have to change my pants. <laughs> Greg yeah. actually dying. Um, infused did pick up. Infused probably just gonna move on. Actually, here Sarah's nowhere close to Uber. It's only two players spotting now. Brook and Gamble's gonna be a little bit late to the fight though. Infused's gonna go in. Scout first. The soldiers following up, Dunk. Why are you not following your team? Why are you frenching out on us here? We should not, <laughs> should not let this happen. <laughs> As uh, Nine Men is definitely going to defend her solidly. Sarah did go down though. I didn't. I actually. Yeah, yeah. It was that. just normal. He was just bombing in. Took down, took down three rockets onto the medic. He's like, ah, what are you going to do? That's okay. So Greg is a. Uh, well, I would say slightly over times with fifty percent. Still not going crits. I would have expected Fuse to just run like full time crits consistently because it's just more fun. Felisco taking snipers, probably his uh, childhood dream after he got through soldier medical school. And um, let's see, yeah, he is going to snipe. You take down Clive, that's a scout pick. That's always good if you pick a scout as a sniper. Cookie did go down though, which is not going to work out. We just heard Bone saying, medic down, demo weak. So Bone's going to do something awesome in 90 it's seconds. Gonna, I was to, all right, 90 <laughs> seconds from now. We gotta, see, they're, they're they're gonna gonna check that. They got popped up by Greg. Sarah not even close to having this Uber and with Clive and Sticko, the only players alive. Surely Infuse is gonna cap this off. And we're gonna have Greg coming in with the Uber saw Clive getting a pick in. But that is all she wrote as Infuse is gonna pick up this game. Five to two, and now it is official. Like Infuse is gonna win. Infuse is gonna move to the upper bracket final, etc. etc. Yeah, et yeah. We all knew this, but with two minutes remaining, something awesome might happen this middle. Uh especially with uh with Bone right there and 
gotta, gotta yeah, Bones aren't completely mad. I, I think we should take a look at Bones and then make fun of him. Yeah, I just only time. have to click like 11 times to get to him. That's okay. Like, you know, hate it when that happens. You go like, oh, I'm gonna go to the next player. And it's like, <laughs> next, next. Come on, come on. Go for it. Uh. <laughs> well, yeah, of course you're gonna scroll the other way. Uh, okay, Bones is doing thank you, nothing. <laughs> Guys, B Bones is doing absolutely nothing. So this is probably the worst guy I could expect all that game. <laughs> Gambles got taken down. They're doing absolutely nothing. He's going, he's going behind. <laughs> is, is Bones going behind? I'm gonna look at it. Oh, there he comes. Bones is coming in. Uh, he, he said he was gonna take down the medic, didn't he? Like, it, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's gonna, gonna medic demo was we? It, okay, he tags a demo man. That's pretty much all. And uh, pretty much all that is going to happen right now is that Bones is going to miss every single one of his shots. That is a good plan. It's a good way forward. That's the way you want to do it. It's just miss every single shot you can possibly land on. Oh, anyone. I know he's going in. I know he's going in. He's going for a dick stun. The medic. There we go. And Demo Man is weak. Oh, Bones. We were waiting <laughs> for that moment. Oh, I'm beautiful right there. What? Why is he not in prep? That guy's fantastic. That is, he's amazing. Oh. 45 seconds left on the clock though, this game has ended a long time ago, ladies and gentlemen. As there's a couple of meat shots coming in from the side here. Uh, nine men is going to play for this middle, definitely, because they just want to put in the effort. Are they going to take down the middle? I think Infused just going to say, nope, this is ours, we're going to go in. And nine men is going to say, no, we're with nine instead of six. Uh, they're probably going to be participating in the Highland tournament after this. I uh, should do, yeah. Oh yeah, they should. <laughs> there we go, Pyro there. Nice, 20, uh, 20 yeah. seconds remaining, ladies and gentlemen. This has been it. This is the first upper bracket final round two match that we've had so far here at I-45. We're going to move on to Elemental Violence versus Zumba next. And uh, that is actually a weird matchup to have already. It is probably the most difficult matchup for Elemental Violence so far, apart from Infused. And we're going to move on to that game in about just a second, ladies and gentlemen. So stay tuned, please, for the next game after uh, Infused just beat nine men 5-2, to two, purely off-classing. Uh, stay tuned for uh, more action here with Elemental Violence and uh, Zumba. My name is Pledge. My name is Comedian. And please stay tuned to Vanilla TV.